Last year this was all underwater. There's a big old dam over there. In previous videos you can see it. And uh, flooding went ahead and took care of that. It has been torn asunder and the entire thing washed out. Washed out the bank. You can't walk through there anymore. And this was all under two, three, four feet of water, depending on which spot. It was a clear up to the grass line up here and backing up in there. So about about two and a half, three feet higher than this. And what I find most interesting, besides it just looking cool, is all this stuff. I would really like to put that on my garden. I might have to come through here and scoop some of it up somehow. It's all algae and everything. Everything that was caught in here in the decaying, flooded zone, and everything that's captured off the land, it was pooled here for a period of time. Lots of fertility, and thus the algae, which is a plant, is growing. And so like manure, the algae can be used as well as the fact that this water and this muck here has got to be pretty high in fertility for it to get this much algae grown so something to keep an eye out for if you're ever you know looking for fertilizer off the land this is like some quick use stuff you know you mix it into your compost or your soil just a little bit and it's going to get you somewhere if you can uh, accumulate some of it and it happens to just occur on the land in places where water pools and you know you get a lot of uh, runoff from the land to capture excess fertilizer and yes um fertilizers in general are made out of gross dead things just so you know it's usually like manure or carcasses or you know yeah basically manure and carcasses is something not much else to fertilize with it's about how it works and so uh yeah free fertilizer Go figure. And the destruction of a beaver dam. I hope they build it again. It's shallow here now, but it's actually deeper upstream. And I kind of liked it when this was here and it was shallower downstream because it was easier to traverse. But, um, no mind. Hope it works out well for the beavers. Anyway, see y'all later.